Bernard Molala, and I'm just going to have a chat with him about the game as well. Well, it was a good game, first of all, to start with Bernard, but where do you think your charges didn't go exactly how you expected them to? Uh, to me, I cannot complain because it's an improvement from our previous match against El Shandy. We were off against El Shandy, but today we shot our, our flashes. We were better than uh, Gormaya as usual, but they won the game. At the end of the day, it's all about the end results and going to the books. So I think we played only 70 minutes out of 90 minutes. You see, they were, the kill keeper was, I mean, on third uh, match, he was just going down, wasting time after they, we had conceded. So for me, I cannot complain. My, my boys did well, and sometimes it's just like a wave. Maybe we have been doing well against Gormaya. Maybe this is our time. Now this is the second time we are losing against them in a row. So I cannot complain. We just have to go pick ourselves and see what we can do about uh, our improvement in, in, in finishing. Yeah, you said you didn't know this Gormaya. Could that have contributed to your performance? A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Um, actually, I didn't know which team I'm going to play. And you can see I was doing my part and my, did, my team did uh, uh, their part as we had planned. Only that they had only one shot and it damaged us. And that's football now. So we cannot complain anymore. Coach, tell me something. In the first half, it looked like you're relying overly on the fast break. In the second half, again, you're relying on lumping the balls forward. Was this the plan for this game or is this the plan for Bandari to play like that? No, it only changed when we conceded. It only changed when we conceded. It was only 10 minutes to go. I had to bring in another defender, push Brian Oteno up front so that he can win those balls. So our plan worked, but we did not score. But I, I, I think we, we did well today. Thank you very much and good luck uh, coaching your next match. You. Uh, I'm going to be talking to the coach Polak of Gurbaya. He's obviously under a lot of pressure. He's got to join the others in celebrating. There are many other people who want to shake his hand as well. Many other people who want to compliment him. Maybe I should be the first to say congratulations. You. Winning your first match for Gurbaya. How does it feel? What do you think about the team? Well, you know, the, it's, um, the result, we won 1-0. It wasn't the prettiest of games, I don't think so. But, you know, we try to play football. And, um, but at the end of the day, it's the result, and we won 1-0. I'm happy again with the players, with their attitude, especially when we went, went down to 10 men. They made it difficult for us. They're a strong side, they're a physical side. And um, I think, you know, I've got to be aware of these when we play against them the next time. You've got a depth in bench. But that depth then was used in the very last part of the game. Uh, are you now comfortable with how you're going to field your players? Well, yeah, like I said, um, um, I've only been here like my second week. So they've got to get an understanding of how I play and how, and how we're going to play with the ball and without the ball. Second half, I felt we was a little bit better in, in the balance of the team. First half, we was a little bit out of shape a little bit. But second half, I felt a bit better. And of course, we scored the goal, which you now I'm happy. And like I said earlier, um, the development of the game, the way we play will come every, other, every week. We play will come better and better. Thank you very much, Coach. Good luck in your next game as well. And welcome to Kenya.